the glittering gold trophy is right in front the three gold medals in his neck he needs no introduction joining me is the face of indian pickleball arman bhatia arman many many congratulations what you're seeing in your front how does this feel or dream end to the pwr super india masters for you yeah it feels great um i'm so happy that i could go through all three events and um get a gold by the end of it It's been nothing but a fantastic week and I'm so happy to have um won a triple crown in uh one of the biggest tournaments in India and yeah I'd like to thank all my partners my team and everyone who came down and supported me my friends family um quick message to them is that I love you all and thank you so much for being there Arman let's go match by match let's start with the singles match i don't think anyone is forgetting that match anytime soon the third game 0-8 down against dusty boyer and you were giving yourself chances there was self belief in you what was going on in your uh, mind from being 0-8 down to winning the singles title um i was honestly very blank but i had my boys by my side i had purav and harsh by my side and all they did was kept making me believe in me And yeah, we ended up pulling through. And the mixed doubles with uh, Ruse, how was that? I spoke to her as well and she was talking about how you were the calming factor in the entire match. So tell us a little about that as well and that match as well. Um Rose and I have um we played the MLP season 1 together, Australia, and um after that we played one more event. In total in probably 20 odd matches we've lost just two. No actually more from this tournament so Rose and I have made a great pair and um we trust each other and that's what's helped And now let's come to the men's doubles you and Harsh of course um the biggest pair in Indian pickleball at this moment tell us about this match it was the easiest of the wins in the three matches uh, that you've had it seemed like you were you know stormed past uh, the the opponents um Yeah, it was it was uh, relatively easier but um it was still a great match. Mitch and Roman played really well and um Harsh and I just did our thing where we were focused locked in from the start and we've just um gone and cruised through. It was in cruise control throughout. Arman also let's talk about the tournament uh, PWR Duper India Masters. Uh, what do you think of your experience having played here the top pro players here about 70 of them 750 uh, players in total and let me give you some more statistics 2300 matches in 4 days have been uh, conducted so word on the tournament. Um it was a lovely tournament. I've had I've been treated very well over here and with a lot of respect and um I've been showered with so much love over here that um I'd definitely come back. And yeah it was a great tournament congratulations to the organizers congratulations to the everyone here the tournament director from the staff to the the support team to everyone they've done nothing but a wonderful job and um I would I would love to come back over here and play and also talk to us about the crowd support that you had there were a little kids here as well who were cheering for you every point every match whether it was singles whether it was mixed doubles or uh, even uh, the late match which was the men's uh, doubles they sat here cheering for every point that arman bhatia won that must have felt special no it was it was adorable honestly um mm-hmm. it just filled my heart with joy with um seeing the kids being there and um i wish that could motivate a lot of them to play play pickleball and I see a lot of people in the country still do not believe that you can make a career out of it but yes you can make a career out of it so if you're good I would just say that believe in yourself back your abilities and keep going after it And Arman you know when we talk about pickleball a lot of people think about America a lot of people think about Australia but now do you feel that people are going to be start starting to think about India Um yeah I feel they should um India is second to America right now just because I feel we started a little later but we're catching up we're catching up um let's for instance Harsh and I went back to the US Open last um in April and we we placed fifth but I again feel that if we stay in there play a little more out there we'd be up there 100% Arman you've been a busy man collecting trophies and having the gold medals but have you had any time to speak to your uh, parents you just told me your father doesn't like you uh, watch uh, watching you play no, he doesn't not like me watching he doesn't not like watching me play but he just a little um, he gets a little hyper <laughs> so he prefers not but my my mum had all her friends and her sit down this spend the entire evening i had my grandparents actually stay up till 1 am on the day when i was playing singles they actually sat through the whole day and watched my matches um friends and families throughout um mumbai abroad 
the states everywhere they've just stayed and watched the match and today was a big day for everyone so everyone i've just got a call from my mom i'm going to call my dad soon and yeah uh, they're super happy i've had my brother by my side throughout the week which has been really special so yeah and have you had any time to think about how the celebration is going to happen because you don't have one or two you have three celebrations to plan I'm not sure but there's definitely going to be a party once I get back home to Mumbai. I'm going to have all my friends and family come over and uh, we're definitely going to do something then. And that was that's something I thought about. Nothing as to what we're going to do tonight. I think uh, my main man Sam over here is going to decide what we're going to do tonight. And Arman if I were to put you in a spot and ask you to pick your favorite trophy or favorite medal which one would that be? Easy question? Yeah, I think today <laughs> just goes for the singles. It's been a rough week with the singles but I'm um, glad we got through it. Arman thank you so much for speaking to us and wish you all the very best. No thank you so much I appreciate it.